Yo, what, what, what up? 你要见还是我？ It's Razor Bob. She may be tiny, she may be only fifteen, but when she opens her mouth and sings, she's no longer just the person you see. Singapore's Rachel Chua bowled everyone over at Taiwan's One Million Star Season Five Singing Contest. With a majority and big voice, the pine-sized girl got a high score with a rendition of Dai Ai Ling's "I Will Get It." Dao. Experience, only 15 years. Love is only 30 years. She got to the next round smoothly with two other Singapore contestants, Huang Zhiyang and Huang Shunda. 是让制作单位看了叹为观止，真为特别。Unfortunately, the other Singapore representative Chen Tia did not manage to stay on for the next round of contest. Now back in Singapore, Razor Pop speaks to the humble 15-year-old Rachel Chua to find out how she feels about her win. Hey, hi, Rachel. Now, Rachel is also Ai Jia, right? Tai Ai Jia. And、uh, first of all, I'd like to congratulate you on your win. Yes, in one million stars. How was it? How do you feel when you won the contest? <laughs> Blank, lost. Cause、um, I see、um, everybody like jumping in joy.、Mm-hmm. Then I felt lost. I was really not in the situation.、Uh, maybe I was just like a bit tired. So when, after I sing and I got a result, I was like, "Huh, twenty five? Okay, gone, lost. <laughs> I'm already in my own space." Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Hey, so when do you return to Singapore?、Uh, on Monday night. Yeah. So.、Okay. It was at Terminal One, and after that, most of my friends came to pick me up. Yeah, so they were very excited and、uh, very happy for you too. I'm very sure. Yeah, and I have a few friends who went to Taiwan with me,、mm-hmm. and they are very supportive. When they came back, they are all oh, you know, they just they're so eager to tell the news to everybody. Yeah. Do you still feel like you're walking on air now? You know, still in that space, very happy, very elated. I haven't been feeling very elated yet, because、okay. yeah, but I just felt happy that I have um, like. 评判老师们 ，like all the judges, they they gave me that such good comments, and they actually told me like where I can improve on and all. So I felt very happy that actually this experience, I've not only gained、um, the marks, ah,、uh, the marks is really not important. But I think what's、uh, what's more important is the experience and what I've learned from there. It's a process that counts. That's cool. Yeah. For this contest, you particularly chose two songs, which is a、uh, Dai Ai Ling's "Wo Gai De Dao,"、yeah. which we heard over at Radio One Hundred Point Three just now, which is really fantastic, and also、uh, Zhang Xiaohan's "Bu Tong." Yeah. Why these two songs and not others? Are, are they your favorite singers? Uh, because "Bu Tong" the song itself, it touched me like really. It touched the song touched me, and it's really me. The song is really me, and the lyrics is very meaningful. Whereas the other song, "Wokai Tadao," is a song that I sang in Singapore for the Singapore PK round, and、uh, it's the song that I really did well, and it,、um, it helped me go to Taiwan. Like it was a bonus, so I thought I want to present that song in Taiwan to let everybody hear, and I would just like to reminisce the past, like you know, remember the past, like how they did it in Singapore, and I would just bring that, bring the attitude there, and I would do it there as well. So how well prepared were you? Were you nervous at all? I was nervous when I was on the stage, like for that first moment. Now then, Tao Zijie, the MC there, actually, is like. She just keep joking with me, teasing with me, and she just keep talking to me. So I felt, hey, okay, I'm relaxed now. Then I start the singing, yeah. And the competitors there were very friendly. Like they actually come up to you and say, hey, Jiao. Like even you are there to com- to compete with them, so they actually say, hey, Jiao. So it's like you really feel close, and you really feel like, hey, this is really a sharing session, yeah.